How's it going, guys? And welcome back to another JHR review. Today, we're looking at a really cute gotcha. This is called a ham egg. Now, it's a little hamster gotcha, and if you've been on my channel for a little while, you know what gotchas are. They're basically uh, gambling, because you don't know what one you're going to get. It's kind of a mystery prize, but you know it's going to be around this theme. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at the box, though. Let's go ahead and focus in on this. So we have the option to get quite a few of these guys. We have this um, black one right here with an egg on top. We got this kind of um, orange hamster. We have these two little nuggets down here at the bottom, a uh, kind of orange and white and a gray and white. We turn it to the back. This is by the Capsule Foundation. I reviewed some of their stuff before. Some stuff in Japanese. And then we have this side as well, which I believe you can also get uh, some of these guys too, which is really cute. I like the ones that are standing up. I hope I get one of those. And then the bottom right here. This is actually distributed by Clever Idiots. They are the same people, I believe, that did the Why Am I Sushi Cats that I really like. If you want to pause right here, it says Choking Hazard, Small Parts, Not for Children Under 3 Years Old. But without further ado, let's go ahead and open this guy up and see what hamster we got. There we go. And right behind these flaps right here, we're going to see the one that we got. Let's do this. And... Whew. What did we get? Let's see. We got... The gray one. And that one is really cute. I wish I would've got a standing one, but I mean, at the same time, all of these are really adorable. Let's go ahead and slide this out of the packaging. And take a closer look. Focus in. Look how cute that face is. I wish they wouldn't have put the seam line right there, though. That does take away from the effect a little bit, but I mean, it's like a $5 gotcha, you can't expect the world, you know? But from this angle right here, it looks really, really cute. Eyes have a pretty decent sheen to them. It looks just like hamster eyes. I actually have a hamster, so... You know, the same one you guys have seen before. Yeah, he's still around. He's kicking. And here's the egg on top. A little, uh, less yellow than I thought it would be, but... It still looks pretty cool. We have a little nub tail at the back. And on the bottom we have the little tiny hamster feet. How cute is that? Take it around the front again. And one more look. I just really wish the seam line would have been different or maybe they would have filed it out a little bit. Because that's where it's injected, the mold is injected and it just seems like they could have quality control just a little bit more. Paint job's pretty good though, you can see inside the ear. What do you guys think? Is this something that you would buy? Do you think that you want a whole collection of hamsters? Let's see what else they have in the box. Comes with a little booklet right here. Not sure it's gonna show anything else besides what's on the outside. Let's open it up just cause. There we go. Yeah, it shows the same pictures of the ones that we saw on the box. And then some more information. But I think that it's worth it. Honestly, this is probably going to be going on my 
fiance's desk with all of her other little collectibles. She has a nice pink gaming computer, and I think this will match her theming very well. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, a huge shout out to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your support. You guys are awesome. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.